All right, all right, all right. We are jumping into our 2017 Bruno Sangiovese. Um, the more Italian you say it, the better it tastes. So let's jump right into this wine. It is a lighter, lighter wine, but it smells amazing. Um, picture going to a berry farm and all the aromas coming out. That's exactly what you get off of this Sangiovese. A ton of strawberry on the nose, like candied strawberry, like you're going to cut into a strawberry shortcake. That's what I get off of this. Uh, if you can't tell, I'm excited about it. I love this wine. I think it's a great summertime red because of that reason. Um, and for others, we'll jump into it. But you get the strawberry right on the nose. It's so overpowering with berry notes that that's, uh, and I hate saying that because there's such a cop out. If you, if you, there's a secret. If you want to uh, sound like you know what you're talking about when you're drinking red wines, say it tastes like red fruit or red berries, almost all of them always do. Insider piece, don't tell anybody. So you definitely get that strawberry. But what you also get is a little bit of tartness, like, a, like you're biting into a fresh cranberry. Not that tart, um, but you definitely get like a cranberry-ness piece to it as well. It does, as it's sitting on my palate, gets dry. And that is one of the reasons why I love this red for the summertime. Now, when I think red in the summertime, I think grilling. So when you have a wine or um, grilling items, when, you, when you're grilling protein, typically they have a fat, higher fat content. They have those char marks. I think uh, something light like lamb, uh, even chicken skewers you could do with this wine. Uh, smaller, like a steak with no toppings you could get away with, with with this wine. Something I really, really love is, you know those goat cheese logs where they have like the cranberry? This has enough tannins to stick up to that goat cheese fat, but it also complements itself with the cranberry um, notes and the cranberry on the, the goat cheese. So if you're going to cut yourself a goat cheese little, little cracker spread, definitely pair it with this Sangiovese. Give it a shot. Uh, you won't regret it. Enjoy, folks.